Hello guys, today I am going to explain about the topic Hadoop Distributions. See, uh, those who are going to watch for the first time, please like, share and subscribe my channel guys. So let's go into the topic now. See, how many number of uh, Hadoop Distributors are there means in the market? Uh, uh, actually, if you take uh, all the big data analytics uh, and all the, we, we are having lot of vendors are there who is going to provide the Hadoop services. So, what type of services that are needed by the Hadoop? All these services will be provided by the many number of clients here. Many number of uh, organizations are there or many number of vendors are there. So, who are those different kinds of vendors? Let's see. See, we are having the six different kinds of vendors are there. First one is the Amazon Elastic MapReduce. Amazon Elastic MapReduce. Second one is the Cloudera. Cloudera CDH Hadoop Distribution. Cloudera CDH stands for Cloudera Hadoop Distribution. And third one is the Hortonworks Data Platform, HDP. We can call it like the HDP. Hortonworks is one of the vendor where it will provide all the services. And MapR Hadoop Distribution, MapR uh, Hadoop Distribution and IBM Open Platforms and uh, Microsoft Azure HD Insights. So this is also the cloud-based Hadoop Distribution where Amazon Elastic MapReduce is completely given by the vendor Amazon. And whereas here uh, Microsoft Azure, uh, it is also providing the cloud-based Hadoop services where it is going to be provided by the Microsoft company. So all these six are completely uh, the six different kinds of vendors where they will provide all the different kinds of services uh, for the Hadoop. So let's see the first one that is the Amazon Elastic MapReduce. What is this Amazon Elastic MapReduce? Elastic, it means if you want to stretch. So how much you want to stretch? Uh, that much uh, we can stretch it, right? That means uh, it is very flexible. In the same way, if you take this Amazon Elastic Map Reduce, it is going to provide a lot of web services where we will use it for the big data processing and uh, analysis purpose. Usually, we will use the, all these things for the analysis purpose. So for the analysis, we need a lot of huge amount of massive data sets will be there. So we need to analyze such type of data sets where we can store all these uh, uh, type of data sets so we, we should store the data, right? Then only we can go for the analysis part. So then what we are going to do, I can use any sort of cloud services. So it can be Amazon, it can be Azure, it can be any other uh, uh, cloud services I am going to use uh, in order to analyze my data. So here Amazon markets, EMR, we can call it like in short, we can call it like EMR, Elastic Map Reduce, where these are completely expandable and uh, these will provide the low configuration services which will provide an alternative to uh, running on the premise cloud uh, premises we are going to run all these things and amazon emr is based on the apache hadoop it is completely based upon the apache hadoop uh, where it is completely based upon the java programming so if you take the hadoop programs all the hadoop programs are completely based upon the java programming one, and which will supports the processing of large data sets in a distributed computing environment where it will support uh, the large amount of data sets will be supported by the Amazon Elastic Map Reduce, whereas it will support the distributed computing also. That means parallel computing and we can store our data in the multiple nodes and as well as we can go for the parallel processing also. And using the Map Reduce, the core component of the Hadoop software framework uh, developers, they can write the programs to process the massive amounts of the unstructured data here. So here we can write the programs in such a way that we can analyze the lot of unstructured data. See, Hadoop means it will not analyze only the structured data. It will analyze the unstructured data, semi-structured data and the structured data also. All the different kinds of data types can be analyzed by the big data. So here, uh, this is one type of provider that is Amazon Elastic Map Reduce. And uh, second wonder is the Cloudera. Cloudera CDH Hadoop Distribution. So Cloudera is one of the very good important tool where this is completely responsible again for the analysis purpose see that means again for providing all the hadoop based services see cloudera's open source platform distribution which includes the apache hadoop and it is built specifically to meet the enterprise demands so cloudera is the market trends in the hadoop space and it is the first one to release the commercial hadoop distribution and it offers consulting services so what type of services it will provide it will try to provide the services in such a way that we have to build the gap between the clients and as well as the how to provide us. So what does the actual organization needs? Only those services will be provided by this cloud errors. So cloud error distribution, it is very fast for the business applications and it is a 
Hadoop can uh, easily manage all these things and it is a uh, secure without compromise. So if you see this is the complete GUI of uh, the cloud era. So we will be having clusters, hosts, diagnosis, audits, charts, administration things are there. If you see here uh, how many number of hosts are there for the Hadoop we can take it like uh, HBase, HDFS, Hive, View, Impala, Spark. Uh, Kafka, many things are there in that uh, cloud era. These are we can treat it like the host or we can treat it like the components of the hub. All the services will be provided here, right? So, this is about the cloud era and uh, Hortonworks data platform. Third one is the Hortonworks data platform. What is this Hortonworks data platform? Usually, this is completely uh, secure, rich, enterprise ready. Enterprise ready means uh, this is already well developed application where this is uh, ready for using all the services that can be provided by the HDP platforms. And uh, open source uh, Apache Hadoop distribution based upon the centralized architecture. So we know that uh, already HDFL, uh, we are having the few important components like the YARN. YARN is basically a job scheduler and it will low, works like an operating system usually to allocate the jobs, to remove the jobs, to reallocate the resources, to remove the resources. Uh, to which uh, resources the clusters, uh, to which clusters the resources are needed. All these things are completely managed by the YARN. And uh, HDP addresses the needs of the data at rest. So usually HDP is going to provide the services that uh, for such a type of data which is already at rest. And it will powers the real time customer applications and delivers the robust analytics that help accelerate the decision making and the innovation. So, whatever the data which is already developed and stored, only such data can be analyzed here. And the Hortonworks, usually this was developed by the Yahoo engineers. So, Yahoo developers, they developed this HDP platform and it will provide only the service based uh, distribution model for the Hadoop. And the Hortonworks, it is completely different from the other Hadoop distribution as it is the open enterprise data platform available free for user. So, this is also where freely we can uh, use this uh, Hortonworks. Hortonworks Hadoop distribution, it can be easily downloaded and integrated uh, um, for use in the various applications. See, if you take the applications like eBay, Samsung, Electronics, Bloomberg and so uh, Spotify, use the HDP. There are many applications where they are going to use the HDP, Hortonworks data platforms also. And Host, uh, Hortonworks was the first vendor to provide the production ready Hadoop based distribution. That is the 2.0 was provided by this HDP. And uh, HDP is the only Hadoop distribution which will support the Windows platform. Users can deploy a Windows based Hadoop cluster on Azure. So we can use the Hadoop based uh, cluster. Cluster environments can be provided by the one is the Microsoft and one is the Amazon. AWS also will provide the cloud based services through the HD inside services. So these are the three different types of models of uh, Hortonworks, Cloudera and as well as the Amazon Elastic Mavericks. So I hope you like this video guys. Thank you for watching.